So for lots of cash, we have two different engines we can uh, launch. We have Memcached and Redis. Um, and there is a difference between these two um, engines. We don't really need to know in great detail, um, you know, all the differences, but we do have this nice big chart that shows you that Redis ticks more boxes than Memcache. Uh, so you can see that Redis can do snapshots, replication, transa transactions, pub, sub, and support geospatial support. So you might think that Redis is the clear winner here, but it really comes down to your use case. So Memcache is generally preferred for caching HTML fragments. Um, and Memcache is a simple key value store. And that trade off there is that even though it's simpler and has less features, it's going to be extremely fast. And then you have Redis on the other side, where it has different kinds of operations uh, that you can do on your data and different data structures that are available to you. It's really good for leaderboards or tracking, unread not uh, notification, any kind of like real time uh, cached information that has some logic to it. Redis is going to be your choice there. Um, it's very fast. We could argue to say who is faster than um, the other because on the internet, some people say Redis is overtaking Memcache even in the most basic stuff. But generally, you know, for um, for the exam, Memcache is technically or generally considered faster for HTML uh, fragments, okay? Um, but, you know, it doesn't really matter because on the exam, they're not going to really ask you to choose between Memcache and Redis, but you do need to know the difference.